Depression is a real thing. Depression is a real thing. When you're going through a major change in your life, depression is a real thing. And going on this journey right here is no joke. Is no joke. What are the things that I would suggest to someone? Right now, I am about, I lost track. That's one thing. I thought that I would be able to keep track and let you know how long I've been in this lifestyle, this, this toothless, this teethless journey, teethless society. I have lost track, but I can probably say I've been in this journey for about now. Hmm. Oh, uh, let's see. Before I'm I'm about to say about a little over two years. You know, um, my dental journey, I don't know. I can't tell you that. But what I can tell you is that depression is a real thing. You have to make a list. And I say you have to because it's like necessary for survival. You know, you need to adapt. Adapt to the, oh shit. You know, adapt to the, what the fuck? You got to adapt to that. Then you make adjustments. And then you achieve small goals along the way. How do you do that? How do you adapt? You got to re -in it's like reconstruct, re-engineer how you see it and how you think about it. Wake up and take that shower. Be okay with looking at your face like this. And trust me, I have seen major changes. This right here. See? I even try to paint my nails, but I wash my hands a lot. So the nail polish comes off. I'm going to do that again. I like to look at... At least, let me look at whatever I have felt was pretty. Even though I still think I'm pretty. I'm just a different kind of pretty. You know, it took me a minute to get there. But it's real. The changes that your body goes through. Look, I have this natural sadness thing going on here. And from what I'm understanding, this is like the signature. Almost like, you know, if you've ever been like from the school of hard knocks. That you see someone that does a particular type of drug and you're like, oh wow, they have like the coke face or the crack face. Well, hello everybody, Juju over here got the teethless journey face. And you know what? It's okay. And if it's not okay right now, it'll be okay. But one thing we're not going to do is we're not going to stay sad. For very much long. You could visit sadness. Because that's part of grieving. You're grieving something. And that's okay. <laughs> we need to adapt. How do you adapt? Do the things that bring you a little bit of happiness. Even while you have no teeth. A nice cup of coffee. Woo! You know what it's like to drink coffee? Anything hot or cold and your teeth don't hurt? Mm, think about that one. We're going to leave it there. Look for the next video. What we're not going to do is stay sad for too long. We are stronger together. There's a lot of people in here that helped me on this journey. And I hope that, I'm, that I can help you on your journey too. We're going to adapt. We're going to adjust. And we're going to achieve small goals along the way. Please leave your comments below and let me know. How I can encourage you. How can I inspire you. It was done for me. And I would love to pay it forward. Have a powerful day my friends. Have a powerful day. Do the things that bring you just. A little bit closer. To having your happiness. And getting through this journey. Because it's not for the weak at heart. It's not. And you could do this. Once upon a time I thought I couldn't. You could do this. Peace.